And Hillary Clinton's running mate, Tim Kaine, was in Milwaukee today campaigning at Lakefront Brewery. Ricky Mitchell was at the event. She talked to people who turned out to see the Democratic VP nominee. Well, you know, this election cycle has led some people to say that they may not just vote this year, but we did talk to one woman who was at today's event who said that is a very disheartening thing for her to hear. For Katherine Green, it's not about whether people vote Republican or Democrat, only that they vote. For myself as an African American, I know that uh, my ancestors, my forefathers, my foremothers died for us to have this right to vote. Born and raised in Milwaukee, Green says she volunteers to help educate potential voters. While she says she's voting Democrat this year, she cares more about the process. And it's not about blue, it's not about red, it is about all Americans. I don't care if you have some different political views, but it should not rise to the level that you're going to ignore the Constitution. Cain touched on the voting subject during his Milwaukee speech, bringing up a federal judge's recent ruling that struck down certain voting restrictions in Wisconsin. If you meet anybody between now and Election Day who tells you that they don't think their vote matters, then here's what you ought to say to them. If you don't think your vote matters, then why is the other side working so hard to make sure that you can't vote. Voting is some power. It is not all power, but we must all exercise it and participate in it. And with that in mind, we are now less than 100 days from the presidential election. Reporting live from Lakefront Brewery, Ricky Mitchell, today's TMJ4. And